Hey guys, okay, so we are, like you saw, sitting at about 1.30ish. Um, I've been sitting about 1.30 the last couple days on good days, but we're gonna pose, do our check-ins. It is a refeed day, which I'm really excited about. This is probably the most embarrassing thing I've done on prep, and I'm literally having to go into the parking lot to do my check-in. I was doing my check-in just in my backyard, but since I'm visiting my boyfriend like on the way to my show, I don't have a fenced-in backyard. We're eating a lot of food today, which I'm really excited about. Uh, as well though, it is a rest day and we have no cardio. So the goal for today is to relax. I'm gonna get my hair done, I'm gonna get my nails done, it's gonna be a great vlog, so let's get started. Okay, I just took all my check-in pictures out here as well. Now that we're done embarrassing ourselves, we're three days out. I didn't even mention that. Okay, so it's Wednesday. We are three days out from our second national show ever and last show of the season. Um, we're doing junior nationals in Chattanooga, Tennessee. Okay, so we are looking at our meal plan for today. We do have our usual salt and usual steps and we're going up to seven liters of water, which is not two gallons, a little bit less, I think. And then let's start with breakfast. So we're doing all of our normal sources. So there's a couple things that um, might be a little bit different, but besides that, I'm just getting more of my normal stuff. So for breakfast, we're starting out with 200 grams of egg whites, 70 grams of cream of rice, and 20 grams of dark chocolate. Now, if y'all don't know, that's double the amount of cream of rice I normally get. So I'm very excited about this. Also, bruh, this lighting. That's crazy. We also have the king here himself with his savory oats. And Love he's going to join me to get his little toes done. Get my toes done. We're going to get a little pedicure together. Hey, yo, shout out Renee. Savory oats gang. I hate savory oats. Uh, sweet creamer rice gang, except there's no sugar in this. Because we can't have sugar right now. No fake sugar. No fake sugar, just cinnamon and, and dark chocolate. <laughs> the post prep, post show cream of rice is going to slap. I can already tell. Like you're gonna like do a bunch of like fun and crazy stuff in there. I already have prepared. Wait. Literally, I already planned. I have s'mores protein powder, and I'm gonna put. I'm gonna do a baked oats, but I'm gonna have the dark chocolate pull on top, and I'm gonna put the mini marshmallows in the center. You know what you're gonna do? <laughs> so it'll be like a leveled up dark chocolate bowl. Oh, you you put s'mores on the inside. You have to get like the honey like... grams, like, you know how like, they have like cinnamon toast crunch seasoning? You have to find like honey grams, like seasoning or something like that, and like do that on there, or get like graham crackers and like smush yeah, it up. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. Like, season on there. Like Imagine that. like breaking open, like doing a dark chocolate pool and then breaking it in half, and there's a bunch of marshmallows. Ah, <laughs> ah chef's kiss. On that note, we're having plain cinnamon cream of rice with 10 grams of dark chocolate on top. Still, best part of my day. All right, took a bite. So good. 200 grams of egg whites today. And then we're having plain black coffee. Like I said, we can't have any fake sugars. Um, a lot of people ask why. Due to inflammation, I'm drinking two gallons of water. I'm seven liters, almost two gallons of water today. Um, and salt is normal. So a lot of stuff is going to be starting to be manipulated in the next couple days, but today, no fake sugar. I won't lie, cream of rice is not as good without stevia in it, but we are surviving, and it's so good with the dark chocolate. So we're going to eat this, and then we're going to go get our little toes done. Okay, so went on a little hot girl walk this morning after uh, breakfast, just to make sure I start getting my steps in. Um, Parksa came with me. Impulsive purchase, but needed. I've been looking online for some running shoes just because firstly I've been doing my cardio and like my gym shoes, which are like Converse blazers and they're painful, right? And I've kind of committed, I'm telling y'all because this is gonna keep me committed. I wanna start actually running uh, post prep just to keep myself enjoying cardio, I guess. 
So I got some hokas. I got some black ones, which are literally gorgeous. Love it, love it. Um, so they're the Clifton 8s, if you were wondering, but they're just so soft. I didn't realize how cushiony they were, so I'm really excited about that. I also went to CVS on my hot girl walk, and um, we got our hot, girl walk. our hot girl walk, me and Parsa's hot girl walk. Um, I got some stick-on fingernails, so me and Parsa are going to go get our toes done soon, hopefully. Um, and I got press-on nails, as well as like setting spray and eyeliner from e.l.f. Um, and that was kind of the rest of the stuff I needed to do my makeup on show day. We are here. Parsa, you ready for your toes to get done? I am ready for my toes to get done. <laughs> I'm trying to pick out my color, and Parsa, I realize, brought his protein oatmeal in here. Okay, I'm gonna rub my feet, I might as well eat while I get a pedicure. Oh my gosh. <laughs> okay, so we are back. Got my toes done. For my nails, like I said, I'm gonna do press on fingernails. Parsa's gonna go take a nap. I'm drinking cold brew instead. So I am having my uh, second meal now. It is 100 grams of chicken with 100 grams of cooked vegetables. With three rice cakes, I'm using these lightly salted, natural, organic rice cakes. I don't know. Um, so three rice cakes and 15 grams of peanut butter, and I'll show you what that looks like. And this is it in all of its glory. Rice cakes, peanut butter, chicken. Okay, we are on to meal three out of five. It is 2.30. I'm gonna go get a blowout for my hair, and they're gonna glaze and like tone it and everything for my show. Um, but I'm going to show you meal three. I've been feeling amazing when I tell you on the low carb days mentally, like I, I'm just dead and exhausted. And I feel like I'm just like not myself. Like I don't have my personality and I don't have my energy. I feel great today. So I'm kind of, I'm excited for the off season to actually have energy again. Um, but I'm having a bagel which bagel number one of two of the day. I absolutely love bagels, so I'm excited about this. Um, the bagels that I'm having are these ones, the Dave Killer Bread, Dave's Killer Bread one and the Everything Bagel. So we're gonna do that. Um, but in general, I just wanted to say I'm feeling mentally amazing. Yeah, of course we'll reassess at the end of the day, but I'm just like, trying to enjoy the day and just not stress about what's coming. My coach and my posing coach have both been like amazing resources the last couple days and like really, really supportive. And I really wouldn't be here without them, but in general, feeling amazing, excited about what we're bringing because no matter what, I brought what the judges asked for from my last show. Like they said, coming leaner, coming tighter glutes. Uh, and I am. That is literally what I'm bringing. So, and they said it's happened. <laughs> so it's nothing drastic, but it's, it, there's definitely a difference and I'm excited to kind of show it off. So let me show you what we eat. This is the next meal, 100 grams of chicken, 100 grams of broccoli and bagel. Nice plain bagel. Still amazing though. I was worried it'd be nasty without anything on it. It's really good. Nice. Bruh. Okay, what? Um, I never get blowouts, ever. Um, and I was like, you know, my hair always feels really good after I get it done. Maybe I should get a blowout and they just like styled it. I feel like a new woman. Like, honestly, I feel so good. Um, I thought this would help just so when I like add curl at the end of this week, I don't know. I don't know why I thought it was a good idea. And it was, it's not that expensive to get a blowout because they're just like washing your hair, but they put a toner and everything on it. Bruh, it, oh, I can't even get over it. It looks so good and so clean. Um, So I'm going to leave it like this until show day. Just add dry shampoo into it show day and add more curls. So it's like kind of dirty. Um, But when I curl it, but it looks so good. Ah, I feel amazing. Yeah, this hair, obviously the curls are falling out because my hair is crazy. Um, the moment, love it. Uh, basically, also, like I said, I had two gallons of water to drink today and I started thinking about it and I was like, I have maybe had half a gallon today and it's 5 p.m. So, your girl just gulped down half a gallon and I'm like, 
feeling like a balloon could pop. I just drank so much water. My problem is, is I drink water way too late in the day and then I wake up 20 times in the middle of the night to pee. You can't finish your water at 11 p.m. You just can't do it. So, gulping down water. Once I finish the rest of this glass, I'll be at 100 milliliters, which is not even a gallon. Oh, pray for me. Pray for me. Oh, she's so excited. <laughs> Little first puppy feature. Come here. Come here. Oh. Oh, she's so, <laughs> so adorable. <laughs> oh. Bagel number two of the day. We have one normal bagel and then 20 grams of strawberry jam. Second favorite part of the day, my next bagel. Only one gets jam, sadly, but it's still so good. I'm gonna be having a bagel literally every single day. Post prep, I swear. Nice. I'm gonna do this and then lay down, take a nap. Um, feeling pretty good. I just feel exhausted, which, oh, puppy hit the tripod. No, you're good. Um, so, just feel exhausted. I'm an aunt right now. The puppy's coming to hang out. Um, and I want a dog, but puppies also make me not want a dog at the same time. So, Cat vibes. Um, <laughs> but yeah, this is good. I'm gonna eat this and then watch the show and take a nap after they leave. Okay, well, now that we're down uh, six liters of water, I literally feel like I could pop. Um, so we have very little water left, which is very surprising. I gulp, it's 7 p.m. now. I gulp down that much water in two hours, crazy. Um, we're on to our next meal. I think it's meal four and it is 200 grams of egg whites with 60 grams of cream of rice. Nothing crazy. We're going to have one more meal in a minute, which I'll show you. I've just been trying to relax. I put a bunch of Epsom salt into my bath and I did, um, like I exfoliate to start getting my skin ready for the tan. Uh, but nothing too crazy. Just kind of trying to relax, but I'll show you my next meal in a minute. Here's the gorgeous meal for though. Egg whites and cream of rice. Okay, last meal of the day. Four rice cakes and 100 grams of chicken. Not gonna lie, I feel uncomfortably full. Um, I'm not sure if it's the water, I'm not sure if it's all the food. I'm not sure, but very, very full. Um, but I know I'm gonna wake up tomorrow and be extremely like starving. Every day that I have like a refeed the day after, I'm like starving because all the food digesting. I don't even know how it works. Um, but I'm going to end the video here. I'm going to edit this and try to get it out literally tomorrow. So, cause I head on the road to Tennessee tomorrow. Um, mentally I talked a lot about how I was feeling last year and I kind of feel the same. Um, our last video I talked about how I was feeling mentally and I feel the same. Physically better because of all the food today, which is great. Mentally a little bit more just like nervous not for the show day but with the post show and realizing that like right now is my best physique it's sometimes hard to realize and like accept and i'm excited for the post show to be able to enjoy life a little bit and i'm going to try to focus on that because like kind of being like oh yeah this is the leanest of my body's going to be um for the next year is like crazy to think about um but i know my body needs rest and telling myself that and realizing that like okay like with the final stretch and I'm going to enjoy where I'm at right now and that it needs to come to an end and that chapter needs to fold so my body can rest and recover and heal um so but on that note I love y'all thank you for watching we are we're almost there so uh, make sure to like make sure to comment make sure to subscribe and my next video if this is a three-day out, out vlog I might do a two-day out vlog and then we're gonna have show day so Love y'all and have a great rest of your day. <laughs>